Yo, what up, what up? On the way to the gym, Glog24. Today I'm gonna bring to you a little thing that Arnold shared with me, which obviously I already kinda had knew, but once your idol says it to you, especially if a man of that that uh, magnitude, it really means something, especially in the moment. <clears throat> right when I had left MP, I don't know, a few months later I ran into Arnold and uh, that was after he had already left at Venice Beach. I was just working out. I didn't tell him I was in town. Just ran into him and he was like, you know, he took me out to breakfast and he said, look, man, here's the deal. It's all how you stand up from adversity. I went through a lot of different business stuff and personal things over the years. And it's all like, <clears throat> you have no choice. Like, you know, you're gonna go through this kind of stuff if you're always pushing the envelope always trying to get better you know always trying new things and being yourself that it's all how you stand up and honestly in that moment I didn't really like <clears throat> say anything except for I was just kind of retaining it but I kind of nodded and was like exactly like a lot of people would just expect me to probably you know just kind of disappear right so with max effort being in our and old school being at the arnold at the presence we were um me being involved with the charity again uh with after school all stars at the event <clears throat> it's just the way that my social influence has continued it's one of those things that i took that challenge uh when i decided to leave and, and go back out on my own again not on my own but with a new team that you know it was always like internal hashtag no fall off you know walked out of there signed with Reebok started a new brand started CoreyGFitness.com which has been really successful and the no fall off it's all how you react it's all how you stand up that, that's been my internal hashtag I'm already on fire every day waking up because of my driving purpose the ultimate thing I'm trying to accomplish but when you add the advice of Arnold <clears throat> challenging you on how you stand up after adversity in business life it means a lot more and I think just kind of the way that Arnold has thrown stuff at me over the years like that you know because I don't spend a lot of time with him but you know I do get a, I do get a chance a few times a year uh, and I can reach out whenever I need. I don't use it as, as often as maybe I should, but it's one of those things where I value the time I do get because he's so busy, So and, and I'm super grateful for it. But that's the thing I kind of wanted to share with you guys today, and that's something that's kind of keep keeps me moving because, look, not very many people get to work with their idol, straight up. Um, Arnold, you know, 70. So I feel real blessed to be able to work with him and for him to see, you know, kind of a few things that I've been building. <clears throat> and when he shares something like that, how do you not respond? I mean, straight up. So I think that that's one of the things that like, it keeps bouncing around in my head that, you know, what I was doing, I thought maybe was the end-all be-all of my business, but really it's just a stepping stone. And that when Arnold kind of challenged me like that, I was already taking that internal challenge, but he just spoke it a little bit more into reality for me to kind of have a little bit even more fire. And I believe I'm showing him and myself and my family and anybody who's paying attention that um, there's a common denominator of of what's happening out here and that you know I'm pushing and it's exciting that it's working and I appreciate the support I appreciate look I like doing these type of things <clears throat> on the way to the gym uh, plus listening to personal development and I think that um, I did have one guy at the Arnold say dude I just started watching the glogs and he actually said the word glog so I was pumped so dude I don't remember your name but I appreciate you I want to give you a shout out. You came over, you were over top of the t-shirts. You looked over at me, said, dude, I just started watching the vlog. I was in. So anyway, hope you guys are doing well. Peace.